Hi, good morning to you and happy Friday, everybody. Yes, Bradley is getting $20 million from the federal government. Most of it is going to be going to their checked baggage inspection system. And if you're from Connecticut and you come here to Bradley or not, you know that this area especially can get pretty busy when the airport is busy. People are coming in here. Plus, the checked baggage system is right near the ticket counter. So this can be a busy and uh, a backed up area, especially when a lot of people are here. So this money will help create an inline checked baggage system with an airport wide baggage handling system. This all also comes on the heels of another $210 million project where they just built a ground transportation center at the airport, offering more parking and better access to rental cars and public transit buses. Now that opens up to passengers next week. So we caught up with one woman at the airport this morning and her dog, of course, about these recent changes. She says so many improvements have been made here at Bradley over the years. She can remember when it wasn't so great decades ago. Take a listen. Decades ago, um, probably not as much convenience for, for the travelers, um, the drop-off areas, um, the parking. Now, the latest expansion also includes rather some updates to the HVAC system. They're going to be adding elevators and making the bathroom more ADA accessible. Now, since we're here by the boards, let's take a look here. Pretty much everything on time at this point, just a few delays. So if you're heading out to Bradley right now, it is not so busy. Let's take a look over there for everybody at home. If you're heading out or have any family coming here soon, everything seems to be running smoothly and not a lot of people here right now, but a lot of changes coming here to Bradley and the people we've spoken with this morning say they're excited about all of it. We'll send it back to you in the studio.